Remedies to control dandruff. Dandruff can be caused by a number of things, including dry skin, oily skin, seborrheic dermatitis, and sensitivity to hair care products. Common symptoms of dandruff include white, oily-looking flakes of dead skin in your hair and on your shoulders, and an itchy, scaling scalp. While dandruff is not a serious condition, it can be uncomfortable and embarrassing, but it is not harmful or contagious. There are many methods to get rid of dandruff, depending on the cause and severity of your condition. So, let's discuss about the most effective ways to control your dandruff. First is apple cider vinegar. Apple cider vinegar helps balance the pH level of the scalp, which can reduce the growth of yeast that contributes to dandruff. It also has antimicrobial properties that can combat fungal infections. To use it, mix equal parts of apple cider vinegar and water. After shampooing, apply the mixture to your scalp and let it sit for 5 to 10 minutes. Then rinse your scalp thoroughly. Next is tea tree oil. Tea tree oil has antifungal and antimicrobial properties that can help eliminate the yeast-causing dandruff. It also reduces scalp inflammation and itching. For maximum benefits, add a few drops of tea tree oil to your regular shampoo or mix it with a carrier oil like coconut oil. Massage the mixture into your scalp, leave it on for a few minutes, then rinse thoroughly. Next is aloe vera. Aloe vera has soothing and moisturizing properties that can alleviate dryness and reduce scalp irritation. It also has antifungal properties that can help combat dandruff-causing fungi. To use it, extract fresh aloe vera gel from the leaf and apply it directly to your scalp. Leave it on for 15 to 20 minutes before rinsing it off. Repeat a few times a week. Over time, you will begin to observe the effect. Next is baking soda. Baking soda acts as an exfoliant, removing dead skin cells and reducing flakes. It also helps balance the pH level of the scalp. Wet your hair and scalp, then rub a handful of baking soda onto your scalp. Leave it on for a couple of minutes before rinsing thoroughly. Be cautious not to use it too frequently, as it can be drying for your scalp. Next is coconut oil. Coconut oil is a natural moisturizer that helps combat dryness and reduces the appearance of flakes. It also possesses antifungal properties. Warm up some coconut oil and massage it into your scalp. Leave it on overnight or for a few hours before washing it out with a gentle shampoo. Repeat a few times a week. Next in our list is lemon juice. Lemon juice contains citric acid, which helps balance the pH level of the scalp and reduces dandruff-causing yeast. It also acts as a natural astringent controlling oil production. Dilute freshly squeezed lemon juice with water and apply it to your scalp. Leave it on for 5 to 10 minutes before rinsing thoroughly. Avoid using this remedy if you have any scalp cuts or open wounds. Next is camphor. Camphor has antifungal properties that can help fight dandruff. Camphor has a cooling sensation when applied topically. This cooling effect can provide relief from itchiness and scalp irritation, which are common symptoms of dandruff. To use, Mix a few drops of camphor oil with coconut oil and massage it into your scalp. Leave it on for 30 minutes before rinsing it out. Next is rosemary extract. Rosemary contains compounds like rosmarinic acid and cineol, which have antimicrobial properties. It also has anti-inflammatory properties. These properties may help combat the growth of fungi or yeast on the scalp, including the ones that cause dandruff. An excessive production of sebum, which is nothing but natural scalp oil, can contribute to dandruff. By balancing the oil production, rosemary may help reduce the occurrence of dandruff. Now let's see how to use it. You can use it in two different ways. One is rosemary oil scalp massage and other one is rosemary infused rinse. For rosemary oil scalp massage, dilute a few drops of rosemary oil in coconut oil or olive oil. Massage the mixture into your scalp for a few minutes and leave it on for about 30 minutes before shampooing your hair. For rosemary infused rinse, Prepare a rosemary infusion by steeping fresh or dried rosemary leaves in hot water for about 30 minutes. After shampooing, rinse your hair with the cooled rosemary infusion. Next is neem oil. Neem oil contains antifungal compounds that can combat the overgrowth of dandruff-causing fungi. It also has anti-inflammatory properties that can reduce scalp inflammation, relieving itching and redness associated with dandruff. Neem oil's fatty acids help moisturize the scalp, reducing dryness and flaking. It also promotes a balanced scalp pH, improves blood circulation, and nourishes the hair follicles, contributing to a healthier scalp and potentially reducing dandruff. 
to use, mix a few drops of neem oil with coconut oil and massage it into your scalp. Leave it on for 30 minutes before rinsing it out. Next are fenugreek seeds. They contain mucilage, which moisturizes the scalp and reduces dryness and flakiness associated with dandruff. They also have anti-inflammatory properties that can soothe an irritated scalp and alleviate itching and inflammation. Fenugreek seeds possess antifungal properties that may help control the overgrowth of fungi or yeast on the scalp, which can contribute to dandruff. To use, soak two tablespoons of fenugreek seeds in water overnight and grind them into a paste. Apply the paste to your scalp and leave it on for 30 minutes before rinsing it out. Apart from these methods, you may also consider following. First, practice proper hair hygiene. Avoid using excessive hairstyling products, as they can contribute to the buildup of oils and dead skin cells. Additionally, avoid sharing combs, brushes, or towels to prevent the spread of dandruff-causing fungi. Second, massage your scalp. Regularly massaging your scalp, while shampooing or using a natural oil, such as coconut oil or tea tree oil, can help improve blood circulation and prevent dryness. Leave the oil on your scalp for a few hours before washing it out. Third, maintain a healthy diet. A balanced diet that includes foods rich in vitamins and minerals can promote a healthy scalp. Ensure you consume foods containing omega-3 fatty acids, zinc, B vitamins, and antioxidants. Fourth, manage stress levels. Stress can worsen dandruff symptoms. Engage in stress-reducing activities like exercise, meditation, or hobbies to help control dandruff. Fifth, avoid hot water and excessive heat styling. Hot water can strip your scalp of natural oils, leading to dryness and dandruff. Similarly, excessive heat styling, such as blow-drying or using flat irons, can contribute to a dry scalp. Opt for lukewarm water and limit the use of heat styling tools. Hope you like the video. Comment below and subscribe our channel to follow more.